Yeah, what's up, everybody? I forgot to change the picture. Hold on. What's going on, Kermit? How you doing? There we go. And it's too big, of course. That's better. All right, there we go. All right. So let's continue where we left off. From where I remember where we left off, we had just beaten, we just fought Malos the first time, and we have to go get this orb from him because that he stole from the Torn in the Capital. said to go out of town and around the side or something. Uh, nice, nice. Aren't we intrepid? Aren't we intrepid? I'm something of an expert. Nature makes a fine ally. a fine ally. Boys, 
Taken twice as long if I'd had to do it alone. Hero great sword. Huh? This is becoming addictive. Treasure trove. The suspense is killing me. Not this way either, was it to the right then? Oh, it was a. Okay. It was a, a unique enemy. Name Tombstone for it. That's why it had so much health for being level 33. I was just supposed to do it from town, and I went the wrong way. Um, it doesn't look like it, to be honest. So. I think I'm going to, um... Oh. Let's go over there. What a pleasant stroll. 
Right. Where shall we head to next? What you got? Remember, if you came here for fish, you'd be sorely disappointed. There's not a single one left around here. You saw it too, didn't you? Damn Aegis and his mooks ruin everything. Look these brilliant, shining wings. And the light they show off somehow end up killing off all the fish. I'm not going to give up. I'll fill these pails of mine with fish little by little. I'll get the shoal going strong once again. You don't think you'd be able to help, do you? You don't have to bring me the fish you catch. I'm going to collect as many kinds of fish as possible unless it's difficult to do by myself. I'll be glad of the help. You scratch our backs, and we'll scratch yours. I can I probably have any have some fish in here, let's see. I have 15 of those, 16 of those, and two of those. That gives 15, that's actually really good. Mint fish give 14. That's great, just enough to get me started. And I'll get them in my trusty pail straight away. You seem to be swimming around happily enough. Yes, indeed. Spirited enough to match the dauntless courage of Tornin Knights. People of capital will be most pleased. Hey, Gian, what do you think about these fish? They seem grown enough to eat, by my assessment. If I can be so bold, may I suggest carpaccio? Not quite what I meant. Terrific. Well then, I'll raise them carefully, so it'll be the prettiest fish you've ever seen. Thank you ever so much. Okay, next up is the front moat. It needs to be full of fish till the Aegis attack the capital. The moat was teeming with life. I know you don't know me or anything, but I'm really counting on you to help. Will you catch some fish we can use to restock the moat? That would be such a lift to the atmosphere of the area if we could get the moat back to how it used to be. I really do, do hope you'll be able to help. Let's see if I've got that kind of fish. Oh baby, yeah we do. Windy fish. Tiny tongue shark, that's 30. Give him a windy fish, that's 14. Mint fish is 13 this time. Eel salmon is 12. Windy fish was 15 now. Wow, that's great. Can't believe I managed to get so many. Hey, just a moment. I'll be back in all in no time. They're beautiful. Ah, oh, what a sight. A typical torn in scene if ever there was one. It seems that there are some things Mal Malos cannot destroy. That's the lesson we must take from this. That's right. We can't allow these small pleasures to be taken from us again. Seeing all the fish swimming happily really brings the area back to life. No, that's not true at all. The only way we're bringing this place back to life is by pulling together and looking to the future. Still, I couldn't have gotten this far without your help. I'll take care of these little fellows. You have my word on that. And once again, thank you. Alright. We got a friend. Well done, us. How about next time you help yourselves? Try chip, huh? So wind, it's so wind, wind, earth. We're gonna put wind, wind at the end as well. Ice, water, wind. So combo. Water, earth, wind, also. I know this. Earth, fire, earth. No. That's what I'm thinking, though. First off, we got some stuff. I don't know. I forget all who. Someone's gonna go into everybody's affinity chart. Ah, Minoff learned something. A welcome improvement. And a Geon learned something. I cannot disregard. All right. <clears throat> Let's see what these tri-chips do. Oh. Okay.
Hmm. Not really a huge boost. Let me see. So, Harvest Heal. Any max attack is on. Oh, I need to get her some stuff. I don't use her really, though, in combat, but... So what I want to do, though, is I think I want to give Adam, oops, on hand arts, I actually want professor oh, is. This is to give him the arrow great sword. Oh, and I have a, like a two, a rarity two, one of those two, which is going to be good. This way he'll be wind. Have him stay earth for now. We have what? What do we have for him for this? <clears throat> this is a lot. This is lightning and great for rank two, thirty two. This is better block rate. That's lightning. He's got an earth one at rarity two. I guess it doesn't really matter what she has, per se. I'm gonna give her Earth. Just because, like, the blade combo I'm looking at setting up is, is Ice Water Wind. Which will be Jen, Eugeon, and Adam. Anyway. Oh, it's like, whatever. Get that out of the way. So. Because of big grade, lots of shortages of things are a big problem for lots of folks. So, Mamimi get Pyrithium trade guilds send over relief packages for no money. Mamimi just make it happen. Strangely generous act for Mamimi, you say? Actually, holding out some odd to Needy Pond is family tradition of Mama Mamimi. Now that friend says, it is strange. Strange, strange tradition of family of Mamimi. But perhaps in future Mamimi is Needy Pond and will get a Samad from a Kindy Pond. Oh. Well, no, I'm just getting a new. Oh, well, actually, let's see what happens when we go over here. The main quest is over here. Ah yes, this door. We made it. Good stuff. Doesn't seem so bad. There are some green barrels. You're coming with me, treasure. You're coming with me, treasure. Treasure. Trove. 
The suspense <laughs> is killing me. Quick defense too. Oh. I don't see anything really use spikes yet, but it doesn't mean they won't. Okay, so now we have a quick uh, a quick point here. It's fine. A fast travel point. They not serve big portions here. Meh? You want Omnom for something? <laughs> it's eating and its name is Omnom. Nice. Omnom in middle of meal now. We'll help later. Wait. Hold, hold thought about Omnom. Friends not happen to have food? This place make Omnom angry. Never feel full after eating. But you still eat here, apparently. <clears throat> if friends have food, could you share could share some with Omnom, pretty please? Omnom happened to be one of the best gourmets out of all Napa. Omnom refuse all food unless it make mouth run like water. Hoping friends can help satisfy appetite. Don't you worry. I've got this. Omnom waited. What kind of food do you have for me? I have one of these. Two of these. I have one of those. Two of these. That should, that's enough. Cool. Ah, full, full up now. Great. Thankings. I'm not feel like I just eat more than stomach size suggests possible, but that's surely just imagination. Now for dessert. Even feminine Napon like Omnom have room for dessert. Looking forward to bringing a dessert will be very tasty. Let's see if I have enough desserts. I have no desserts. Okay. I need to go to a camp like, so that I can make. I don't think I can just make things out of here. No, I think I have to be at a campsite. Alright, well. Let's go to uh, the campsite over here then, shall we? Even on familiar ground, we must stay vigilant. Yeah, about Aren't we nature right here. makes a fine ally. Eat the vegetals. Vegetals. Can't say. So Mithra is the one that really makes dessert. Time to get cooking. I'm kind of excited. Um, actually, it's not always true though. Like, that's a dessert, I think. That's a dessert. Gee, does gin sometimes make desserts? It's hard to tell what they are. Like, a rich platinum bonbon's probably a dessert. Oopa in a bun. <laughs> Make some scorpion cookies. It tastes better than it looks. It tastes better than it looks. Probably. Hmm. Maybe I missed a step. Make some pureed scorpion parfait. It tastes parfaits. better than it looks. It tastes better than it looks. Probably. Oopa in a bun. A Hunger is no, the best spice, bread. right? So this should be um. delicious. Hunger is the best so spice, dessert. right? So this should, it tastes better than it looks. Dessert. All right, I think we made enough desserts. Probably. I'll base it on that last one. Now, who'd make a good lead? Pretty solid, if I say so myself. Can he Shall make we get started? I haven't, seen, I've gotten the part, I haven't gotten the more and more pearl for the golden seeker yet, and that's about it. Prism pickaxe. Make that. Phew! Finished. Electrocyte. Yeah, 
quick time. Phew! Finished. All right. Bonnie Tom Casserole. Adam can make some stuff that's. Yeah, it's a mirror of vanishing. Decreases any attack range by 5%. Proves I've got that. what it takes to work the land. Box of Legions. Make pouch items raised by. Max pouch items raised by 10. Behold! Okay, my masterpiece! See what they have to say. Nick Star Flame, thank you for the raid. Appreciate that. Red Dragonite, thank you for the follow. Welcome to Raptor Paddock. Appreciate support. Nick Star Flame, thank you for the follow. Welcome to Raptor Paddock. Appreciate support. How are y'all doing? What's going on with your stream this lovely Sunday morning slash afternoon, depending where in the world you are? You passed the main gate of Oresco and head right. There's a back gate. You know it. Beyond there lies the way. Azert is waiting for us there. Yes. The uncle is far too busy to be in the city without causing a disturbance. Or far too big to be in the city without causing a disturbance. Yeah, everyone would run a mile with that monster hanging around. Now Milton, if you said that to Azert's face, he'd probably burn you into a crisp with elemental fire. What? <laughs> Don't worry, Milton. He may look scary, but he's a soft old soul, really. Well, isn't that lucky for you, young man? Alright, let's go see him then. Ah, Monday morning for you. Oh, you're, uh... Way far in the future. Thank you, thank you. Appreciate that. Well, let's go ahead and do a rest just to see if we have any levels off of, after fighting that name. Oh, we do. Okay. Let's say after fighting that named creature. I can still improve. That unique creature. I have to. The future is within our grasp. I believe I've gained a little skill. Good old Australia. Gotcha. Okay. Now let's head on back to town. Oops, no, not that one. That one. And see if we have enough desserts. Uh, I just fought Malos in the capital just right. now. Where shall we head to next? Um, or not just now, but last stream. But that was the last big thing I did. I have to go to the uh, the womb to get back the the seal thing that he stole. Om nom love dessert. In fact, Om nom love sweet and salty. Alright, so you give 26 for the sculpting parfait, 20 spicy cookies. Dang, okay, that's easy then. Wish I had something small for that. But these are, let's see, two and one left. I'll just take another spicy sculpting cookie. There you go. Meh meh, now stuffed to bursting. This, that, all delicious. Om nom shower you with thanks. Having a chance to eat so many much, Om nom more stuffed with knowledge about food and cooking than ever. Hope we'll be able to put to good some use, or put to, to good use sometime. For example, could get job where Omnom visit restaurant in every land of Alrest and write about tasty flavors? Or maybe teach recipes for cooking all yummy yummies that Omnom ate in some kind of yummy classroom. But reports and students just take time away from eat. How about do contests where Omnom sit and judge food? Ah! All of this cogitation make Tum Tum of Omnom go grumbly hungry again. Oh Garcon, please br please bring menu. <laughs> Dang, what a weird what a weird nup on. You have my thanks. There we go. That's 20 supporters now. Well, that dude wants the, um... Is Pun Pun the one that wants me to... No, it's Mac Mac. Marcus has another quest for us. There. 
That should do it. XL Magma Saute. Nice recipe there. And a silver feather. Ah, and it is for Jin. Yes, he does have another quest for us. Oh, it's no, it's no use. This is never going to work. Oh, look who it is. Hello again, friend. Oh, you guys. Marcus, wasn't it? You were looking a bit lost there. Need any help? Huh? Oh, no, not really. You're not fooling anyone. You sound really upset just now. Don't try to pass it off as something unimportant. Indeed, why don't you tell us the problem, Marcus? You might be able to do something about it. Hey, Adam. You're sticking your nose in other people's business again. Quit it. Now, Mithra, it always pays to help out your fellow man. You never know when you might need help in return. That's a fair point, I guess, but still. Marcus, care to tell us what's on your mind? Uh, uh, all right. The other day, you helped me... You, you lot helped me catch a load of bugs, yeah? I'm really grateful to you, to all of you, because you did an awesome job, but then I realized I'm kind of useless by myself. This time I decided I'd have a go all on my own. I even made these blueprints for a bug catching machine. But then... But then... I like tinkering with machines, so I know the ins and outs of them, but I've never made one from scratch before. I built everything according to plan, but there's no guarantee it'll work. And now I'm dead nervous about it. And that's what you were mumbling to yourself about, was it? Pretty much. I have to say, making a blueprint like that is really something. It's clear how much time you've invested in this endeavor. Huh? You know how to build stuff, mister? I haven't the faintest idea. <laughs> what? Dumbass. <laughs> Mithra is so rude, and it's funny. Still, it's evident that you're really serious about this. It, it is? The fact that you're worried about it is such a success... Er, 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 the, the, the. the fact that you're worried about its success is a sign of your determination. It's perfectly natural. You've a clear goal in mind, and you'll do anything to achieve it, am I right? I can't see a more noble goal than that. Just give the word and we'll help you out. Have more faith in yourself, Marcus, and let's finish this thing together. That's so nice of you. Okay, then. I'm not giving up. I'll keep trying until I get it working just the way it's supposed to. Okay, so here are the blueprints for Bug Catcher Turbotron BGX 5000. Bug Catcher Turbotron BGX 5000? What an inspired name. Now that's something I wish I'd had when I was a kid. Adam, would you shut your trap for a moment? Not you. You keep going. Uh, right. Well, the machine itself's not quite finished yet. I'm still missing some parts. Probably need about three sunset brackets and a charged shaft. It'd be awesome if you guys could go ahead and pick those up for me. Sir, yes sir. We'll have those parts delivered to you on the double, sir. Boys and their toys. Being nice to kids is one thing, but this is getting beyond a joke. <laughs> Such Man, machine, much wow. <laughs> uh, Alright, let's see if I just happen to have these parts already. Apparently not. Because he didn't just take them from me. Parts I still need are three sunset brackets and charge shaft. Alright. Uh, now I've got to figure that out. Oh, I have to actually get them from people, I guess. Oh, no, this is another quest. Meh, no customers, nothing to do. Meh, meh. Welcome to Obibi's Textiles. Oh, friends not customers? Obibi not have time for window shoppers. Please to scram. What do you mean, I not look busy? Is none of friends business? But friends make valid observation. Nobody came to check out wares of Obibi. Patience is coming end of rope. Not sure why, but even other Nopons seem to keep distance. Maybe time to pack up shop? If only there were an easy way to rake in buckets of gold in one fell swoop. Meh meh, Obibi has it. Obibi recently spied Nopon Little Pond around town never seen before. Little Pond traveling alone at young age is only one possibility. Must be Little Pond of all rest's hottest trade guild name of Voltus. Would owe great debt if friends could ask Little Pond for big inspiration. Obibi wait right here looking forward to news of good news. In troubled times, we help each other. Oh, that kid is over this way. Oh, more this way. 
Ah, this one. Deku Deku, actually. Let me talk to Deku Deku already. Meh? Friends have business with Deku Deku? Ah, indeed, it's true. Deku Deku on Walkie Walkie Pilgrimage. Special rite of passage for Volta's Trade Guild. Is making only minor impression, me know. But pleased to realize Deku Deku carrying Future of Trade Guild on back. It take budding young aspiring merchant like my like self to generate strong cash flow. Meh meh? Friends take interest in Deku Deku and need to ask favor? So textile shop doing poor business and asking Deku Deku to invest. Is very interesting proposal. This perfect opportunity to put financial skills to test. But not to express expect results immediately. Deku Deku need time to draw up business plan. Is no easy road to success. Get rich quick scheme is pie and sky, is pie and sky way of thinking, even if sound delicious. Okay, Deku Deku go ahead and have talk with manager now. Fully understanding situation is key to every successful business transaction. We'll consider options on table and get back to friends when return. active quest. I probably just need to find where those things are. Um, homegrown inventor. I just need to go remember where some old machines are. That's going to be the hard part. Since I only play this game once a week. Remembering where stuff like that is. The boobs. Collect the boobs. Aren't we intrepid? All oh, right, this is a treasure trove I can't open yet, right? I still can't open it. I need threes. Yeah, I need threes. I have two. Structure to this lock. Slow and steady. It's not the end of the world. This is becoming a nature dictator. makes a fine ally. More booze. This you gonna help out this time, Geon? No? Okay, thanks. I don't remember where any old machines are around here, to be honest. That's gonna be a problem. Shall we head to next? Sunset brackets. I think that's what that was saying, because I did see a couple. Yeah, we got the sunset brackets. Oh, I need the charged shaft now. I don't know how long those things take to come back. Coming a nature makes a fine ally. All right, let's see what this guy has to say. You seem to be able folk. I've got a little job for you. <clears throat> you might have noticed that Ferris lived in the vicinity of this here Hyber village. 
Oh, well, it'd help me out greatly if you could defeat a few of the ugly brutes and bring me some ferris beast meat. I normally go out and hunt the ferris myself, but lately they've been more aggressive than normal and I'm not up to taking them on myself. Without ferris beast meat, we can't make hyper meatball stew. Which is to say, we can't make the one famous dish served at Tio's Inn. On top of that, my son's feeling a mighty craving for the stuff and I don't want him to go hungry. Will you help us out? We're relying on you. Okay, easy peasy, lemon squeezy. I'd like you to trust us with this. Do I just have the Ferris piece? I mean, I might actually just have it. I do just have it, okay. That's for reward. I was like, give you the recipe. Yep, yep, yep. Cool. Anyways, the recipe serves you well. I won't lie. It feels good. Glad we were able to help out. Coil chip and art heal too. Let's see how the coil chips are. Not very good. Okay. We'll get some WP stuff. So we got enough to to L to L three some stuff here. Oops. Well, L three. This that. power is for you. Is enough to L three some stuff. Keep giving it my all. A lightning buster. <laughs> this should be wild. Enough doesn't have enough points to do anything really with yet. Let's see. Probably this aggro boosting thing is probably Strength what we need to get. Strength can't be earned through sheer force. And then him. Probably the evasion one. I grow ever more polished. All right. So now also though, see if we have enough stuff in the affinity chart. 3,000, okay, good. So now what I want is... I want um, uh, the use of the art trying to be at the start of battle. This is how I'll protect you I want you that. All. Because I'm gonna want this, I should probably pick this up. I'm coming along in leaps and bounds. All right, let's see Adam here. I was actually thinking about getting that anyway, and that's right above the uh, use one. Signed art B. Let's do this. Standing on the shoulders of Titans. But also this. More to add to my in, case I'm in case I go ahead and use Excellent. him. Alright, now Hugo. Let's see. There's the X art. Y art, that's this one here. 
to be art. So we already did that. We'll go ahead and um, do that. There is still much experience to gain. Probably go ahead and do this. Restore three percent HP when canceling an auto attack with an art. There is still much experience to gain. Okay. That's probably good. Vegetables. We intrepid. I wonder if I go somewhere else and come back if this old machine will be active again. There's gotta be another one around somewhere. So I just don't remember where the old machines are in Tarna. Aren't we in something of an expert? I almost wonder if there's one in that town at the very beginning. Which I believe is the Lasaria region. Important village, I think this is it. I wonder if there's an old machine in here. Nope, this is not the village I'm at. Where shall we head to next? Blown up village. Petley village, that's what I meant. Although I guess I suppose there could be one in the blown up village too. Even on familiar ground, we must stay vigilant. This village is only partially blown up. This is becoming a I know the drill. Lots of boobs. That's a, a thing Malos did to this town. Out Yanchik Harbor. There might be one there. I think there is one in Yanchik Harbor. Now that I think about it. Pleasant stroll. Right. Where yeah, shall we head to there. next? This is becoming addictive. So I did not get one needed out with it. I'm, I'm assuming it's a part, just like the other stuff. We got hmm. This is becoming Marlo. nature makes a fine ally. Let's check this. Maybe, just maybe, there will be something here. It was a nice change of pace. All right, remind me why we're here again. I know the drill. Besides boobs, anyway. Alright, that's probably not it. Let's see if I can go back to, um... Hyper Village if the other one's back. Even on familiar ground, we must stay vigilant. It is. All right. Aren't we intrepid? Nope. 
nothing there yet. Let me do a quick look up. I won't be looking for this forever. Area thing. That's right, I forgot about that. It's like right over here. I actually can see it from here. Right over here. Hmm? Well, out of supplies. This is becoming addictive. So, I got a charge shaft. Okay, good. We're good. Alright. Nope, not a lot of region. Oresco. change of pace. All right, remind me why we're here again. All right, so now we're going to go give the items to Marcus. Thanks guys, this should be enough to get the machine get the machine up and running. I'm this close to finishing it now. Let me go and attach the parts quickly and then I'll bring it straight over. Aha. So this is the fabled bug catcher Turbotron BGX 5000. If you look at that, now this, my friends, is a true work of art. So, how is this thing even supposed to work? Better not be expecting us to lug it around town or anything. Huh? Of course not. It just creates a smoke screen that the insects get drawn to. You just have to take it to a place where there are a lot of bugs and let it run. They'll come straight to you. Bravo, Marcus lied, you are a legend. Thanks, but, um, is it okay if I ask you for guys for another favor? <clears throat> Fire away, we've come this far together. We hardly quit halfway through, can we? We're a team, remember? Yeah, thanks. Go on then, what was it you wanted to ask? Right. You know where the Harad Hills are? Do we? They're near Fel Feltley Village, as I recall. It's some way out of the capital beyond Dynag Desert. That's around about the place where we first met, isn't it? Thing is, I'm looking for a specific type of bug. I hear a lot of them fly around the Harad Hills. Wondering if you could take, take my machine there and collect, and collect some for me. Absolutely we'll do it. Don't you worry, the bug catcher Turbotron BGX 5000 will be safe with us. Yeah, alright. I really hope this works. Oh yeah, one more thing. Um, this being my first ever invention and all, I really want to know if it if it works the way it's supposed to, so make sure you tell me all about it. Oh, you can be sure of it. In the name of Torna, I, Adam Orego, swear it will be done. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. So here we go. Deku, Deku, not believe this. Wearing of clothes is an essential part of strategy. Hmm? What are they arguing about? Merchant selling textiles in birthday suit? Me never seen anything like it. But that just OBB style is not just fashion decision, is way of life. Ah, it customers from earlier. Good to see you again. Is everything alright? It sounded like you two, the two of you were arguing. Oh yes, maybe friends can solve dispute. Friends kindly ask this little pawn from Voltus Trade Guild to assist OBB, yes? It's very wise little pawn. Appreciate much of advice. But this this Deku Deku insists that failure of sale lies in OBB's court because of clothes clotheslessness in buff. It's very rude of Deku Deku to suggest. Maybe rude, but only stating facts. OBB show me fine array of wares. In terms of products, nothing to fault. Can see much effort was put into maintain highest standard of quality. Think with small push, could put out product that steals that steal hearts of Napon far and wide. Could become great hit. But before that happened, manager need to buckle up and put some clothes on. <laughs> Napon who into fashion, also critical of clothing. If manager sell, self not wearing anything, no reason to purchase from. Now hold on a moment. You've got a point to be sure, but let's take a step back and think this through carefully. Don't let anyone tell you how to live your life, Obibi. You just wear what you want to wear. 
Not everything, everyone can be as liberated as you, your highness. Guys, you're not helping. First of all, we should get down to deciding which product it is that we want to put out. If we want it to be popular, I would say it'll need to be something trendy. What do you think? Perhaps? That said, I don't know the first thing about Nopon fashion trends. Same here, I'm just going out on a limb, really. So, we back to square one again? Meh meh. Deku Deku, was it? Yes? You may only come up to, to, up to our ankles, but you're still a member of the Voltus Trade Guild, aren't you? They should know better than any of us what'll sell like hotcakes. Aha! We can use the Trade Guild to gauge interest. I like it. You got a good head on your shoulders there, Minnow. Okay, friends, wait a moment. Let Deku Deku have think. Hmm. Meh meh? Deku Deku, remember now, Napon hat big hit recently in Voltus Apparel range. And top of and and top of that, not very much Napon trade exists in Torna yet. If Obibi can corner market with a with array of fine hats, maybe able to earn big time profit. That that sound like incredible idea. Obibi's textiles actually deal in hats before, so it can make no problem. And if working with hats, then customer is also not so likely to have concerns about naked manager. But we be staying on naturel and proud of it. Good. If we all on the same page, then should start making test product. Start by making test product. Two style styles for hats in vogue at moment is cute and casual. Cute style usually form of knitted hat, adding extra touch of sweetness to nap on noggin. Casual style would be cap with simple design, using single detail for focal point that draw the eye. That rough idea, anyway. Either style surefire hit with nap on. So to make initial hat offering, how much stuffs in ballpark figure OBB expect to need? Meh meh, OBB have to think on that. Cute style and casual style. Okay, have general idea down pat. Blimey, that was fast. Must be really good at her craft, despite being naked. Going to list off materials needed for hat making, so please listen care- so to please to careful listen. First for cute trim knit hat. Will require four cotton branches, two sprigs of angel sage, and one sunflower rope. Then for casual trim cap, you need four corkscrew creepers, three panda pansies, and one heap of floral soil. These resources are only found in Tornet and Gormot, so friends will have to search both places to get hands on. I think that concludes business here for now. I probably will have all that because I always grab everything. All left is for friends to gather necessary materials. First thing first is to produce hats and get business back on feet. And it looks like I do have all that, because I can just talk to her again. Friends pick up everything a BB need for hat making? Oh yeah, I've got plenty of each. That very impressive feat, yes, should be more than enough. It's time to roll up sleeves and get wings flapping. You don't have any sleeves, oh BB. Ta-da! Please to introduce sample A and sample B. Now we'll have Little Pond to sample hats. Would like to ask friends to choose and see if it hit, if hit with customers. Wait, you want us to choose? Are you sure about that? None of us are exactly skilled in commerce. <laughs> it's fine. Friends were ones who helped out in the first place. It only natural that you be ones to decide final sales product. Well, if you put it that way. Okay, we'll be happy to oblige. Then, first we start off with cute style knit hat. What do you think? Does it suit? Next comes Casual Cap. Yes, is also brimming with style. Surely a big hit with Nopon. Well then, friends. It is up to you to make final decision. We'll go with Knit Hat. It's excellent choice. The new product will be Knit Hat. Deku Deku will take stroll around town now wearing hat. Get opinion on street. But we should get to work making much hats as possible to be ready for selling. Meh meh meh. Popularity is through roof. Napon almost climbing over each other to get new product. A baby never seen such sight. Be sure to make huge profit from sales now. So many thanks to friends. Have not enough thanks to give. Eh, it was no big deal. Voltus Trade Guild are a force to be reckoned with if a kid his age is keeping businesses afloat. Ha! Ah, you see nothing yet, friends. Deku Deku not just keep business afloat. We intend to turn it into hottest store in Torna. Looking forward to it. You two just make sure you get on with each other, okay? Oh, there's no problem there, just as long as a baby puts on some clothes first. Oh, please, put sock in it. Right then. A business is alive and kicking. I can see 
I can't see any reason to be hanging around any longer. Agreed. Lead the way, my good sir. But now is not shop in need of re rescue, is Obibi self. <laughs> so we get Obibi and Deku Deku. Two for one. You have we got Obibi. Yep, and Deku Deku. All right. Well, this is two for one special there. All right. So now we gotta do the bug thing. Bolstering sail completed. What do we get? Good enough for you. Sword Strike Talisman recipe, a set of rainbow gloves, and two affinity max evade twos. All right. Oh, Aegeon got key affinity reward, and so did Frigid. Sword Strike Talisman for Haze. All right, we gotta we gotta unlock them, them rank ups there. Hugo putting in work. All right, so Bridget. All right. Think of the possibilities. We got that. Please be this one. Yes. What do we need for lock picking three? To open a lot more treasure troves. Okay then. All right, Egeon, what do you got? It would seem I have much left to Super learn. strength three, which is just to make money. Okay. Okay, so we gotta go, um, to the uh, Harad Hills, which is right here. Whoosh. Even on familiar ground, the question is where here do we vigilant. use the bug thingy? Let me see if I can't uh, set this as... Active quest, so I know where to put it. All right, okay, this way. Out of stock, it seems. Over here, somewhere. Not oh, right here. Okay. This seems as good a spot as any. And on you go. Wow, what is this? A smoke screen for attracting bugs, weren't you listening? Uh, I'm not sure I approve of the smell. Whoa, what's with all the monsters? Hmm, I suppose we can conclude that the smoke is more effective in attracting monsters than bugs. That's just great. Stupid piece of junk. More trouble than it's worth. Guys, we can move about this later. Kind of more pressing matters here. I mean, to be fair, these are bug Spray monsters. Happy to oblige. This is less than tenable. I feel Allow me to take the 
But eventually, I want to be strong enough to protect all of you. I feel the same, Laura. Let us strive toward all this right, goal that. together. Thank you, Aegeon. I'm glad to have you with us. Oh, yeah, them bugs. I assume we have to go back to him and tell him about it didn't work. Yeah, that is the case, it looks like. Even on familiar ground, we must stay vigilant. Hey, you're back. So how'd it go? This is, that's roughly what happened. I'm sorry you couldn't have been more help, lad. Nah, it's fine. It's not your fault anyways. This proves my invention needs more work. This was just a prototype. I guess it'll be a bit longer before I can make that medicine for her. Medicine what now? Wait! Ever so sorry, but would you mind if I borrowed a moment of your time? Uh, sure. I couldn't help but overhear the word invention, you see. Might we attribute this invention to your esteemed persons? Oh no, not us. The honor goes to this boy here. What? What's that? This stripling built it? Who's the geezer? Ah, an excellent question, my dear boy. It is I, the greatest inventor that Torna has ever known, a man known only as Gideon. Um, I wasn't asking you. Now that's entirely besides the point. Gideon has noticed your talent, young man. Of that, you should be thankful. He's not even listening. What is your name, boy? M Marcus, what about it? Marvelous. Well then, from this day forth, Marcus, I would like to take you on or take you under my wing. How about that, eh? What? You want to teach me stuff? Now, nah, thanks. I'm not interested. Good heavens, are you quite sure? Why, I can think of dozens of children who would jump at such a chance. Go ask those other children, then. I don't want to. Wait, let me step in here for a moment. Pardon? Marcus, look at it this way. Ultimately, you want to perfect your machine, yes? Does it matter how you go about doing that? Isn't what matters that you succeed? Ah. I think it would be best for you to learn the skills you need from this man, and then bring your goal to fruition. That is, if you feel you can tolerate his eccentric ramblings. But I think this is well within the realms of your ability, don't you? Yeah, yeah, I get it already. So? Yeah, I'll do it. I'll give it a go. This weirdo knows how to build stuff. He can teach me for all he's worth. I'm not going to let one stupid little failure get me down, nuh uh that's a good lad, if only everyone had your spirit. You sure about this? That was pretty reckless getting him fired up like that. It'll be fine. You learned a valuable lesson today, that failure paves the way to success. If you've risen up from the jaws of defeat once, you can survive in almost any environment after that. And that's not all. Oh? He also reminded me of something I'd almost forgotten. That anyone, if they believe in themselves enough, has the power to overcome any hardship. When you're an adult, it's easy to lose sight of that simple fact. Is that a lesson you had to learn? Maybe, maybe not. Meanie. Anyway, I think we're done here. Time we made a move. See you, Marcus. I'm sure we'll cross paths again. Yeah, bye bye Thanks for everything. Community gained. Thank you. So we only need eight more people for level three. And I saw a quest right behind us. So... Shall we take a look? Homegrown inventor complete. All right. What are we gonna get for that? Give me a shout next time. An armored happens. rucksack recipe and some ox cores. All right. Oh, haze up to B rank. Nice. Oh, that's armored rucksack is a Hugo recipe. Cool. So it's a key item. All right. Let's see. Oops. Let's see what we got. So, hey. Our 
efforts are paying off. Is this? Yes. What do we need for Kenai level three? Just to use wildflower salad twice? Okay. Um. Do I have any? Probably not. Nope. I'll have to make some. Well, at least it will get me there. Anyway, I saw yep, Geo here. Hey, you lot. Hope you don't mind me asking, but are you the ones who go around the place helping people in need? Well, I wouldn't exactly go that far, but we do what we can, I suppose. Good enough for me. Name's Geo. I'm the local handyman. Listen, since you're here, can I ask you a really huge favor? This better be worth our time. Well, I won't lie to you. It won't be straightforward. Troubles of the heart never are. Troubles of the heart? Your troubles, I presume? No, no. It's to do with a pal of mine, actually. We share a table sometimes down at the local. He wants to send a custom-made gift to this lady who's caught his eye, but that's not really my area of expertise. On top of that, one of the key materials he needs is a rare ore that you can only gather at night. I think I know the stuff. Is that a uh, pure stone? Hey, you sure know your geology. You only can you only get it at Hangnail Crossing, and it's used to make sweet nothings. I I think we should help them. It's a wonderful thing to be able to help Love Blossom. I guess we can help out. Besides, it just feels weird to ignore it now. To be honest, Mithra, you want to see how, how this romance pans out, don't you? Don't you put words in my mouth, Bridget. Alright, I think you've got the gist of it. Here's everything you'll need for the job. Two ripple lens, four polar pearl, six rainbow resin. All that's left is to get the pure stone and turn it into something gift-worthy. And, er, I hardly need to tell you this, but it wasn't me who came up with sweet nothings, alright? Sweet nothings indeed, yet who's to say that who's to say the woman's the woman is ever aware of this man's affection? Yeah, it is kind of putting the cart before the horse, isn't it? Anyway, let's give this a shot, shall we? I'm certain it'll be worth it in the long run. Well, it is nighttime. First off, I feel like since I said this is the active quest, this is where it wants me to go for the pure stone. Whoosh. Even on familiar ground, we must stay vigilant. Yep, he wants me to be down there. How do I get down there? I just fall down? Okay, yeah, I just fall down, I guess. This is becoming addictive. Catch some fish. This is becoming addictive. Pure stone. Alright. Now we have to just go somewhere with a campfire. And make it. Change of pace. All right, remind me why we're here again. Let's get down to business. This came out very well. And I think that just about does, or that about does it. Needs a few last finishing touches and we're golden. This is all very exciting, isn't it? Though in all honesty, it will be sad to see it go. Creating items of value for others is part of the charm of being an artisan. And it's especially rewarding to make something for someone you care about. I do hope it will be appreciated. Hey, can I ask you something? How do you even go about making something like this? Oh, something on, someone on your mind, Mithra? You're thinking about Adam. Adam, what? No. I... I just thought, it'd be nice to have one of my own, that's all. Speaking generally, I think it's hard to be able to really express your feelings to someone. Sometimes something as simple as giving them a present can be the answer. 
But what if you manage to screw it all up? How do you cope with that kind of embarrassment? Embarrassment? What matters is you put time and effort to make it. They'll appreciate that. You think? Sure they will. Listen, I know how to make a few basic accessories. Want me to teach you sometime? Oh, that sounds nice. I hope you wouldn't mind me my watching. I'd love to watch too if it's alright. You know, I think I may just participate as well. Mm, yeah, go on then. Great, looks like we can get a group activity going. They look like they're having fun. Oh? Since when did Aegeon get so pally with the girls? Heh, <laughs> good on you, Aegeon. Lucky devil. I wish I knew his secret. Poor Hugo, don't worry though. Your time will come. Going through that stage, are we, your majesty? What, what stage? Jin, please say something. Me? Well, I... Sorry, Hugo. Looks like Jin's with us on this one. I didn't even say anything. Adam? I'll have you know I consider this a form of persecution. <laughs> Inciting your wrath is the last thing I'd want to do. <laughs> yes, make the Emperor of Mordain mad. I want to see if there's anything else... Like, I'm, I'm, I'm a little make that. nervous. Armored rocks. I what to do? Truth. Max pouch items raised by 10. Okay. Oh, I let's see. We want to be able to make... What was it? Crap, it was a salad. Wildflower salad. That was it. I need to, have, I need to make two of these. It's ready. It came together nicely. Alright. And maybe I have gained a level through all this experience? I have. Alright. I fight for my All this friends. quest XP. The future is within our grasp. I believe I've gained a little skill. So much quest XP. Alright. Let's finish leveling up. Good deal. Now we will travel back to the capital. Travel on back to the capital city. Right. Even on familiar ground, we must nothing. stay vigilant. Is it ready? Thanks, you've done a fantastic job. Listen, could you stick around for a moment? I was hoping I could introduce you to my client before you go. I saw him near the palace gardens just now. Besides, after all the hard work you put in, I could hardly tell him I made it, could I? Go on, it won't take a second. And no, before you start getting any ideas, I'm not too embarrassed to give it to him in person. Fashion Gardens, alright? Got that? Good. And don't you dare run out on me. Although, the gate's open, I think, so I didn't have to come All right. up. Alright, remind me why we're here again? Way. Yeah, that gate's open, and he's kind of closer to that. No, maybe not. Get over here. Hey, Geo. Don't tell me. It's finished, isn't it? Sure is. Voila, the genuine article. Oh, it's wonderful. This is exactly what I've been waiting for. Long last, I have it. A way to melt her ice-cold heart. Ice cold? Um, best of luck. Thank you so much, everyone. You're all very kind. Though, er, if you don't mind my asking, who are you? It's harder than expected to find everything I needed and put it together. These people helped me out. Oh my goodness, in that case, allow me to double, no triple my gratitude. It's alright, really. We're just glad to have been able, been able to... Blah, blah, blah. We're just glad to have been of help somehow. I do hope it goes well. Oh, you need to worry on that front. For no woman on all risk can resist my arresting charm, ha ha ha. Did this guy hit his head on something? He's always been like this, I'm afraid. An affliction since birth. Wait for me, Sarah, my beloved. Now I can prove to you that the two of us were lovers in another life. As you can see, he's got a bit of a habit of for falling head over heels. Still, you gotta admire his strength in the face of adversity. Guess I'm a little too grounded in reality for that. Thanks for that. Cool. A happy conclusion. Ah, special level 2 plus 2 and special level 3 plus 2. Nice. Niggity nice. Oh. So we got this guy as a new... Potential person. 
Alright. Oh, Minoth keeping you alone for. Nice. Yo, noise. Alright. More growing to do? Oh boy. Etymology. What do you need for etymology three? Collect stuff. Right on then. I always make sure to get my five veggies a day. How about you? My lady, have you tried this? All right. So that's one wildflower salad. So I just need another. I need that to. I can actually. I can actually do this. I can. I can technically waste it, just to get, just to force it through, which is fine. I'll just do that, and I can just eat another wildflower I salad. I always make sure to get my five veggies a day. How about? And that will once I get out of the menu. Forestry level. Eighteen I level three. I didn't know forestry level two was part of that. Okay. Must have just been. It must have just been kind of like just salad pouch items or something. Diligence and devotion. Yeah. Use vegetables two times for forestry level two, that's what it was. And forestry three is use Hayes crafting skill fifteen times. And I've done it once. Alright, so we have keen eye level three. Now we just need block picking level three and for her to do that we need to find a lot more treasure troves we can open. Like 30 more. 31 more, actually. Well, maybe we can progress a little bit. What's. Ah, yeah, yeah. It's probably just. Yeah, okay, got it. Even on familiar ground, we must stay vigilant. See if there's up. Oh, there's a treasure trove. So that's one more. You're coming with me, treasure. Anything over here? Nope. Okay. place it's the matrix of our titan what does when the time comes this is where blades come to be reborn as titans <gasps> you mean we'll all become titans someday it's nice to be here again after 800 years were you born here too, Azurda? Hmm. After all, I was a blade born from the Tornan Titan. Of course. I don't have any memories of that time. Once a blade becomes a Titan, Interesting. they can live without being bound to the driver who awoke them. One day, they may come to watch over their children as the very ground beneath their feet. And the fleeting bonds become eternal. It's the basis of the Tornan Creed. Eternal bonds. So, what now? 
Malice said he was going to wait. But can we really believe him? I don't think he lied. Why so? He was enjoying himself. That's why. I'd say he's having way too much fun to stop right now. He said that humans long for death. And that he was happy to oblige. Benevolent servant. So, any plans for the rest of the day? Got your award ceremony tomorrow. Best not get carried away. Oh, right. Jin's got a point. You can take a walk around town if you'd like, but in all honesty, we should be. We'd be better off staying at the inn, or by, better off standing by at the inn. Yes, we don't know when we might be next called upon. Well, no one's in the mood to go out. Well, I don't blame them. Am I the only one nervous about the award ceremony? I don't even know what to wear. Uh, you're probably gonna wear the same thing you always do. see if I can go back to Gorma and find any um and go back and find those uh green barrels I couldn't open. See if I can now. It all looks so different. Alright, remind me why we're here again. Excavation here. You're coming Can we do it yet? Something's buried down here. Two and Don't have to tell me yep. twice. Right. And this is probably just like a treasure trove or something. Yeah, so that'll be another treasure trove at least. You're coming with me, treasure. Aren't we in Nature makes a fine ally. Becoming a I'm something of an expert. Aren't we in nature? Makes a vegetables. fine ally. Fresh vegetables. <laughs> this is becoming addictive. I'm something of an expert. You're coming with me, Treasure. Something's buried down here. Don't have to tell me twice. Well done. Suspense is killing me. Another treasure trove. Oh, this was, uh, yeah, that's right. Green barrel. You're coming with me, that, treasure. Yep, super strength two, keen two. Slow and we can steady. open this barrel now.
I should be able to kill these things now. These cray up things. Stay alert, everyone. Don't play around with them. for a nice midday nap. That was a quest I hadn't done yet. Right here. Oh my god, that was like level 30, 34 or something. Even on familiar ground, do it. we must stay vigilant. Be a fun time. Yay, victory! Now, rotting, rotten monsters know bashy, smashy consequences of not fun bothering. Now Pun Pun can enjoy naps with no fear to heart's content. Much thanks to friends. How reliable.
I think we've done what's expected of us. Eel salmon tempura recipe. things I need skills for. Let's see if I have them now. Where's extreme? Right. Where shall we head to next? I probably did it by now. I frankly am amazed. I knew you were good, but I really thought the last part would be too much for you. Nobody has even come close to the level of skill you command. I'm going to let Roly Poly make the final decision, but I'm convinced that he'll take a liking to you. We've arranged to rendezvous in the region of Aletta in Torna. Drop by when you have time, and we can sort things out from there. Well then, be seeing you. I thought I probably had finished that by now. <laughs> Aren't you glad you asked us? Alright. Where are these at? Oh, one's on the ship. Okay. Well, let's do this one first. Do it. An old. Aren't we right intrepid? Got some more parts just in case. Something's buried down here. Don't have to tell me twice. Finding another treasure trove. But every, but every treasure trove counts because I need You're lock coming three with me, treasure. On Bridget, and that is a change it, okay. Three changes. Sort of fighting right here. Alright. And uh, so every treasure trove is one step closer to the edge on that's pretty clean. One step closer to getting uh by picking three. This treasure is right here. Can the I open it yet? Is no, because I need lock picking three. Slow and steady. Can't win the anywhere? Are there any other ones? Yeah, there's one over by this camp. Where's it strong? Right. Where shall we head to next? Oh yeah, right here. You're coming with me. Down down here. Right. Don't have to tell me twice. There's something quite magical about traveling beneath the stars. What am I missing? I guess I have to camp to figure that out. Oh, it's a good thing there's camp right here. So I'm just missing like one thing from the gold thing here, right? Shall we get stuck? Seeker? Yeah, just a Mora Mora pearl. Yeah. Fragrant team decreases out of battle party gauge drain rate. That sounds good. Success. This one okay, I'm so quite make proud the sword of. Strike talisman. I will Asian, challenge myself um, today. Hyper for hyper meatball stew. Steel salmon, steel salmon tempura. Steel salmon. 
tempura. All right, let's see if we got a level while we're at it. Cool. I can still improve. I have to. What's an incredible feeling? All credit to my siblings in arms. into it so we're okay it's up in the tree thing You're coming with me, Something's treasure. Something's buried oh, yeah. down here. Don't have to tell me twice. I mean, I was coming to find more barrels than these, but these will help me towards lock picking, so it's fine. You're coming with me, treasure.
interesting. Coming addictive. All right. This is becoming addictive. I know the drill. Spoiling for a fight. Happy to oblige. Water there, I could have aimed for the water and whatever, but I blame gravity for that one. Don't get careless. Bring the 
Consider our options carefully. We're back here again. We have not this done is yet. I'm something of an expert. I guess I'm not going up there. Because apparently everything is gonna just kill me. here again? <gasps> the suspense is killing Something's me. Something's buried down here. Don't have to tell me twice. You're coming with me, treasure. I do love a bit of peace and quiet. I want to rest now. All right. Any more that I found in this area yet? All right. What a pleasant stroll. Right. Where shall we head to next?
I think we're out of provisions. Ah, we meet again. These are the ones who were test who were skilled enough to pass my test, Rolly. Anyway, this is not good, not good at all. Or are you signing us up for this dangerous mission of yours? Yes, about that. Me must I think of an excuse quick fast. You've seen what we can do, what else do you need? One more time, one one time more, and then need one last test to make extra doubly, triply sure friends have what it takes. Well, you heard the pawn. Sorry, he's the boss. This is getting somewhat irritating. It'd be absolute final test. Swear in life of Roly Poly is evaluation of all skills up to now. Eh, come on, Krugani, throw Roly Poly bone here. Wait, wait, Roly Poly have it. Ten fusion combos. Need to pull off at least that many, or is no go for employment. Yes, that was stroke of genius. Now to go up, please. Walk away. You know what? That actually sounds like it might be fun. I hardly need to explain this to you, but a fusion combo is essentially a combined blade and driver combo. You can add in a blade combo during an active driver combo, or vice versa, whichever works. Like before, you can pick the place in the target. Find somewhere you can make the most of your abilities. This final test, in effect, comprises everything we've been examined on up to date. Alright, we'll do our very best to prove our skills to you. Hey, man. They actually take bait? Inconceivable. Him. He's glad to hear. Once team finished 10 fusion combos, report back to Rolly Poly on quick double. This will be the final test of your abilities. Don't disappoint us now. We cannot turn them away. See what big quests we've got here now. Oh, what could be happening over there? But I can't just go off, can I? What's wrong, Head? When you look troubled, what about him? No, it's just the. I oh, don't know. Sorry, nothing's wrong. It definitely sounded like something was wrong when you were mumbling to yourself a minute ago. Just spill it, man. Nothing gets past you, Lord. Just worried about causing you extra hassle, Lord. Don't want to burden you unnecessarily. I mean, it isn't for you to worry about. Go on now. Let's hear it all. If you say so, well, what it is is that my wife and kids are still back in Gormont, you see. But you hear all kinds of troubling news out of Motherland lately. So you can probably understand why I'm worried. At the same time, I'm the chief Gormati overseer here. So it's not like I can go check on them myself. But you've been there, haven't you, Lord? How's the situation? You've asked a hard question, friend. See, and remnant troops have looted a number of villages there, it's true. Some were hit quite hard. I understand how you feel. If it was me and Aletta was in that kind of piteous circumstance, I too couldn't rest easy. Thank you for saying so, Lord. Well, so long as my village Torgoth is well, I give the architect my thanks. Torgoth? Adam, we have to tell him the truth. Torgoth was burned to cinders. That's impossible. Kali, Kelly, and Nelly, I can't believe it. Kali and Kelly, you said? Are those your children's names? Yes, Lord, but how did you... We met Kali and Kelly during our travels. They were unharmed and are awaiting their father to come and get them. Oh, thank goodness. Lord Adam, would would you... Of course, Hedwin, we'll bring your little ones back to you. Oh, Lord Adam, thank you. Thank you so much. But Hedwin was the father that Callie and Kelly were talking about. They were in Seagull Fell Encampment, weren't they? Well remembered. Let's hurry, then. We never turn a blind eye to people in need. So they're in Gorma. I thought they were. I just wasn't remembering where. Alright, where are you? Oh, 
Let's go to Lashen Cove and just see how far away it is from there. Where shall we head to next? Oh, they're up here. They're up here. They're up here at the hunting camp. Okay. Even on familiar ground, we must stay vigilant. I thought Callie and Kelly would be here. They're not. Not anymore, at least. There are signs that indicate someone left here in a hurry. Could it have been those two? Let's try and find out. Slow and steady. Laser focus. Very nice. Those be Callie and Kelly's footprints. Oh, and a treasure trove. You're coming with me, treasure. Oh, hey, you're the guys from before. Got chased around by some Turkins, and we ended up here. Oh, we found you, though. It did take us a while. Kelly and I have been talking. Since our dad didn't seem to be coming, and living the camp life was just was just the two of us was with just the two of us being too hard. We thought the next time we ran into you guys, t we'd ask you to take us with you to Morrowdain. I guess we could have left some notes in the camp or in Torgoth for Da to find, but... For all I know, I might be dead. The dead folks aren't great at reading. Oh, come on. I'm pouring my heart out to you. What are you smirking for? What? Follow you and I'll see? Sure, okay. Lead on. Jump later. Even on familiar ground, we must stay vigilant. This is more ordained. Looks different than I imagined. Now this is Aletta, a province of Torna. Why'd you bring us here? Well, that's why. Ah! Callie, Kelly, I'm so glad you're alright. We missed you, Da. All's well that ends well. I'm so... glad to help. Are you crying again? Oh, Adam, thank you for the kindness you have shown me and my family. Nonsense, I'm terribly sorry about your wife. Thank you. But at least I still have my children. They're more than I would have had without your help. Together, we'll take care of each other... And honor Nellie's memory. Excellent. Just take it easy. You need to give yourself time to grieve, too. You too, Lord Adam. I know you're the type to put your life on the line for others, but do take care of yourself. You'll be fine. 
He's got all of us here doing his work for him. I'd say he'll be taking it plenty easy. <laughs> nice jab. Thanks, mister. Thanks, miss, and everyone. We'll be living here from now. Or from now, so come play sometime. Sure thing, Callie. See you, Callie. Stay out of trouble now. So all three of them. That was a three for one there. Thank you. Why, thanks. Thank you. We just need three left. They get level three. Then we get the quest done. I'm glad it all worked out. Caramelized seafood recipe. All right. Uh, I think I'm going to call it here. I'm going to send you all over to RGL TV, who's doing a blind race for the Turbo 10, which is 10 Turbo Graphics 16 game race. So we'll, uh, we'll be back Tuesday with some more raids. And uh, hope to see you then. Thanks for watching.